All right, so here we are. I'm gonna show you guys how to make your clips look really sus, just like I do with mine. Um, that fools so many different people. It was clipped directly from here. He said, I just support on K. We'll watch it. Unedited. Alrighty. So that's pretty much the clip. Alrighty. Drag this clip in there. You put it like this. All right. So now it's in Premiere Pro. First thing I do, come up, sequence settings, change that. 1080 horizontal, 1920 vertical. So it's for the, the mobile view. Bam, changes it. Next thing that I'm gonna do, I, I have presets for this, so it makes it really, really easy. Uh, go to effects. This is how it, everybody sees it. He said, I just support on K. That's what he said. All right. Good. All right. So now, now, what I'm going to do is open up my memes. Oh, look at that right here. It's even called hacks. We'll open it up and you see that it's a picture of a hack screen. So what we do next, oops, is we drag that over, put it in here. Because now if I put this anywhere, right? If I put this anywhere, let's just put it right here. Look at that, it's gonna pop up. That's crazy. That's crazy that it does that, right? It's insane. All right, so the next thing that you can do with Premiere Pro, That's what you said. which is where everybody seems to have an issue, this little tool right here, look at it. It says rectangle tool. Isn't that crazy? So, you, you, you know, you, you select it, you come over here, and you draw a little rectangle around this guy, and a little re rectangle around that guy. So those are both grayed out, right? You come over here, hit fill on both of them. You have to select this one too. And then you hit stroke, change. Now you can change the stroke color. So let's just change it to red, like I have it in the video. And then I can change how thick I want the square. So we'll put it right at, right at 11. Um, and I'll have to redraw this square over here, which isn't a big deal. So you just kind of do it like that. Bam. Now, look at this. So now they'll pop up. They don't move though, right? They don't move. So everybody's like, oh, see, we knew you had wall hacks, blah, blah. Okay, hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. All right. So back to where we were. All right. So now I'm going to go ahead. And now that I got both these boxes here. Two different ones. So the top one's this left one. The bottom one is the right one. You could do them both on the same one. Um, it, it's kind of easier to split it up this way. It's more the movement. Movement's more fluent. That's what I'm trying to say. Um, so yeah. But regardless, you still have to come in here frame by frame. Um, I am going to increase this so I can see it a little bit better. And so we can all see it. So it cuts right there. Really, you just have to extend this, extend that. And then, so see how this one is moving? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna left alt, drag a new one over. And we're gonna move this guy right over, so. And then as he gets to the edge of the left side here, gonna go ahead and cut this <clears throat> okay, so now I got that done. So the boxes are done. So this is what it looks like now. Now this is this is what you guys are gonna see. He said I just support on 
Okay. That's what he said. Me. last thing that we have to do and this can be done really wherever in the video um but let's go whoops we're gonna come i think it was right here right here was where my hacks menu popped up aka the picture that everybody thought was real so you just drag and drop it Literally, just drag and drop the picture. Uh, you can get this picture straight off Google, by the way. Um, and you slide it over like that, or you can position it anywhere, really. But I, I had mine over like this, I think. And you just have it up for, for a second or two. So it'll look like that. Um, and then I think it was, I think it was about that long. It, it, might, it might be shorter, but. but anyway, this is the video. That's the video recreated. So I just showed you guys how to create it. Um, I hope this helps some of my other, you know, creator friends out there. Um, if you want to do videos like this and mess with people and kind of kind of do some troll videos, that's how you do it with Premiere Pro. I know there's a bunch of other software out there that you guys can use, but hopefully this helps you. Um, and uh, yeah, for all the ones that are saying it's cheats, well, here you go. It's not. So, GG's.